Have you recently added a new service to your account or changed the plan of an existing service? If so, you may see some unexpected charges on your first bill. In this video, we'll explain why those charges are occurring and let you know what's meant by ProRata. How does ProRata work? The first step to understanding ProRata is to understand your billing cycle. The first bill for a new service will include the normal one month's plan fee, which is charged in advance, plus a partial month or pro rata plan fee. All the pro rata fee does is cover the period from when the service was first activated through to the start of the billing cycle. What if I've changed plans from in arrears billing to in advance billing? If you used to pay for your services at the end of the billing cycle, that's called being billed in arrears. If you've changed to a plan that bills in advance, your first bill for that service will be higher due to a one-off catch-up plan fee. This catch-up plan fee will only be on the first bill following the plan change, so don't worry about seeing it again. What if I cancel my service? If you ever disconnect your service, the advance charge will automatically be credited back to you. I hope this explanation makes pro-rata and catch-up fees a little more clear. 